morning everyone we are in here today because I am ready to do some harvesting and I'll show you what we have before I get started so we have some more cucumbers that are ready to go quite a number of them but what I'm most excited about today is right there Those are finally ready to start harvesting. There you go. And my sister pointed out to me that my tomato in the back, right there, has a hole. And I noticed that while that tomato was still a baby. But because this is my first year of doing a garden, I decided, you know, I'm just going to let it go and see what happens. So that's where we are at with that. And as you can see, the little anti-molly cherries are also doing quite well. So I'm going to get this harvest done. And once we are done harvesting, I will come back and show you what we have. But before we go, let me zoom out. There's my crimsons, red crimsons. They're not quite ready. But the rest of the fruit is doing quite well so we have quite a few of the black cherries to harvest Those are not quite ready yet. So I'm going to get the harvesting done and we'll be right back. I'll show you what we have today. All right, so I'm back. And that's what I've harvested today. So I'm going to go to my green stock and I'm going to harvest a few spinach and I'm going to make a salad. So that's it. And we will see you next time. Oh, uh, before I go, I did not completely harvest everything. And because I do not have any pest pressure, in the greenhouse I'm going to allow whatever I don't need right away to ripen right in the greenhouse and just pick it as I need it because like I've mentioned before there's only two of us 
eating out of the greenhouse. So, so I don't need to pick everything until I'm ready to start canning it and putting it away. So that's it for today. Bye, Tinnies.